Good evening. I am doing this post from a very interesting place in my house. I'm doing it from the hallway of my house um, because the hallway light is the best light for me to show you what I want to show you for this video. Um, I'm going to be doing a product review for um, two products that I got from NYX Cosmetics. So just to give a brief background, um, I've lately I've been really into bright colors in terms of lipstick and blushes and I've been fiending for an orange color blush and the brand and color a lot of people have mentioned that it's like would be great for you know women of color is Taj Mahal from NARS now NARS is a very expensive makeup brand and it's beyond my price range so um, fortunately online there are people who you know offered like cheaper alternatives to NARS and the one company a lot of people mentioned um, was NYX Cosmetics now I wasn't familiar with NYX Cosmetics um, I know they sell them in stores called Ulta which unfortunately they don't have Ultas in Boston um, they have some in neighbor neighboring in suburbs but I don't have a car so it's hard for me to just go over there um, and visit them but so fortunately they do sell NYX Cosmetics online and the color that a lot of people mentioned is that if you want that Taj Mahal color in terms of blush the one they recommended was um, Cinnamon by uh, NYX which I will show you it's really weird doing this up standing up but oh and I'm and I'm wearing it right now I like to wear my blush so I can look like I have like this nice little flushy kind of glow like I just got slapped um, <laughs> I'm gonna use my mouse excuse me <laughs> this is interesting anyway so this is a color and um, it's a really nice color and I have it on now like I said and I just love it it gives this real orangey kind of glowy color that's great for the summer um, and it's just, orange is really just great for um, women of our skin tone I know like you think that is gonna look like clownish but it, it really doesn't and I'm actually quite light-handed with blush I like to look like I have a glow I don't like I'm not a person who has like this you know big old stripe of blush but and this was really inexpensive unfortunately I don't remember how, how much it was but it was uh, pretty inexpensive. Love this product. I also got another blush. So basically, for me, when I buy stuff online, um, if they have like a flat shipping fee, I try to get as like as much products as possible, so that way, you know, I don't have to pay like multiple shipping charges. So for this shipment, I bought three products. Um, that was the cinnamon blush. I also bought the mosaic powder. I'm going to use my mouth again. Sorry. And it is the color Love. I also wore this. Um, and I like it a lot too. Um, it has more of a, like a corally kind of color. And it has some browns in it. So. Um, I don't remember if it was brighter than Love. But I also really love this blush now the third product I bought unfortunately the product I do not like and it's their lipstick and it's called indie flick let me show you sorry I'm shaking <laughs> it's hard to like pull up a lipstick with one hand and anyway, here's the color on the on the next website they describe this color as an orangey cor uh, coral red which I was excited to buy um, let me just put it on the, I this is my second attempt at this video I did a previous video um, and it was quite dark in my room so I don't I need feel that it really showed 
the colors, so I have to I have to do this again. So there it goes. I hate it. <laughs> I let me know what you guys think, but I let me tell you something. When I put on this lipstick, sorry, I have to like close the cap. I just hated how it looked. It looks so clownish to me. Um, not very smooth looking. It looks worse in the daytime. I just, just, oh, just looking at it right now drives me crazy. The only saving grace to this lipstick was that I was able to make it better by applying a uh, lip gloss over it. I don't know if I said the color, but it's called Indie Flick. And, um, yeah, the only way I was able to, like, just make this color bearable for me um, was that I had um, an orange lip gloss. Does it look orange? And it's Sizzle from Revlon. And um, put it on now. It's hard to... Let's go to the top. I think it looks better. Yeah. It looks much better. It gives it a, like a more orange and more in-depth look. Um, I think one of the things I dislike about this lipstick, it looks chalky to me. Um, and I just don't like how it feels on my lips. But with the lip gloss, yeah. This is a great lip gloss, by the way. This is um, one. It's gonna be one of my summer staples. I know it. It's a lip gloss that looks great without all by itself. It looks great over. There's. I use this a lot with another lipstick I like called um, from Sephora, which is like orange red. I don't know what's the color, but what it's called. But it's an orange red. Unfortunately, that lipstick from Sephora is extremely dry because it's a really matte finish, and it just sucks the moisture out of my lips. And by applying this, it moisturizes my lips, but it gives it, it still has that orange color that I'm looking for, so. Yeah. So there you go. That's pretty much it. Um, a thumbs up for the cinnamon blush and the love mosaic blush, sorry. <clears throat> a thumbs down for the lipstick um I one thing I've definitely learned about this experience is oh I forgot to mention so when I purchased the product it took forever to get it I literally I almost I, I, I honestly believe I waited like the shipping was two weeks and you know when it comes to makeup it's about instant gratification and me waiting two weeks for a product is just too much Another thing, I rarely have ever, ever um, buy makeup online if I've never tried it for this reason. Fortunately for me, I love two of the products. The lipstick was a mess. Um, the lipstick was really cheap. It was $6. And the only reason I remember that price from all the products was because I disliked the lipstick so much I was going to return it. But it would have like cost me more to return it than the actual price of the product. So, so that's one of the things I dislike about shopping online. Now, in terms of NYX, um, am I so in love with the product that I will go out of my way to an Ulta to try their products? No. Mm. Um, but if I were ever near one, I'll definitely stop in and see what they've got. Um, yeah. I love the blushes, the lipsticks, not so much. Um, the price was good, so I'm I'm actually quite happy with pretty much, you know, except for the shipping, the lipstick. I'm pretty happy with everything. 
Um, I got my orange color blush that I was looking for and I didn't have to break the bank, which is always fantastic. Um, so that's pretty much it. Next time I do a makeup review, I'm going to have to find another place in my house and not have to do it in the hallway, <laughs> standing like a crazy person. Um, anyways, like always, have a blessed evening. Tell me what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. Um, and that's it. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that's attractive. Ooh, okay, bye.